What is it we have this fine day? Well, what have we got? We've got the HDMI audio return channel and DAC audio converter. HDMI 122, 122, 192, even better. Uh, kilohertz at 24 bit. 3.5 millimeter jack. On the back, we have support HDMI arc. Oh, arc extractor. It's an arc extractor. Uh, optical fiber coaxial input switching function support optical coaxial. Uh, RCA stereo, 3.5 millimeter stereo headphone, also known as 8th inch. Uh, audio output at the same time, uh, simultaneously, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, 3.5mm stereo headphone port equipped with high-performance audio amplifier. Audio transmission of 1.92, 1 1.9, 192 kilohertz audio sampling rate. Optical fiber coaxial interface supports 5.1 channel transmission, signal pass-through, arc, and 3.5mm headphone output, also known as 1 8 inch. Volume can be controlled by TV. Specs. Made of aluminum alloy. It's black. It's powered by USB at 100 milliamp pairs. Working environment, 10 to 55 degrees Celsius. Storage temperature, 20 to 60. Okay. If you're worried about the humidity that you're using this at, my guess is that your application requires... A more substantial high-end piece of gear. Okay. And this is what we get. Now, this was bought at one of those big Mondo, huge, maxi, extra-large, super, extra, califragic, whatever, uh, places. Um, so... There, there, there is no manual, and there isn't so, but there might be more if you buy one from the link in the description, which doesn't cost you any more, but will help me make more videos in the future. Art audio extractor and DAC converter. So this is the front of the back. Who knows? It's got an arc in, so that's where you plug your your HDMI, and then it will extract the audio portion of the HDMI and spit it out coaxially on the coaxial of the spdif um, now they both coaxial and what this is referred to as some people call it light pipe some people call it toss link some people call it uh, optical um, it is uh, spdif format and then coaxial is also spdif format it's just run Instead of running uh, as flashing lights to represent ones and zeros, this uses uh, high-pitched sounds, remember? You know, like fax machines. Oh, some of you are probably too young to remember fax machines. But it uses an audio signal um, to use hot, different frequency pitches for your ones and zeros to make up your digital. 5.5 DC 5 volts. That is going to be a USB micro B that you're going to use for power. And you've got a switch. And the switch is three positions. On the one side, it's arc. So you use the, the this position if you're extracting arc from an HDMI source. Coaxial, if you're using this input here. And SPDIF, if you're using this input there. On the reverse, we have your outputs. So this, I'm guessing, could be used as a digital format converter of sorts. So you can go in arc and then come out toss link or come out coaxial. So if you just, if you've got one type of digital output and a different type of digital input, you can use this to convert. And so you can go in any of these three and come out either SPDIF or coaxial, or analog, your red and white, so you can plug right into an amplifier, or headphones. And you can control the volume via your the output on your TV if you're going in arc. And then you've got a headphone out, so you can monitor what you got going on there, right? Okay, 